As you head out to Chubbuck Days this weekend, there'll be one booth in particular that you want to take your kids to. Joining us today is Alyssa Gardner, who will let your kids decorate a cookie for a good cause. Alyssa, thank you so much for joining us today. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm excited to be here. Now, you are a cancer survivor. Tell yes. us a little bit what that experience was like. Well, I had Hodgkin's lymphoma, and I ended up in primary children's down in Salt Lake for a little while, mm -hmm. and I realized that cancer really is a problem for lots of kids, and there really aren't enough treatments for how many different types there are. Yeah, and you want to do something about it, so what are you doing? I'm holding a bake sale to help Cookies for Kids Cancer raise more money for pediatric cancer research. Okay, very good. And so this is kind of what you're going to be doing tomorrow at Chubbuck Days. Let's uh, let's start doing this. Should we? Because, yeah. Because let's, I, let's decorate some You don't cookies put cookies here. this close to me no. and expect them to survive. <laughs> Star. So uh, kids are going to be able to come up and decorate their own cookie, yeah, right? Yeah, they can just choose any cookie and some frosting and sprinkles. And oh, you cool. do an excellent job here. Are you going to be selling any that are already pre-done? I might be selling these ones, but <laughs> other than if that, they leave no. the studio today. Yeah, yes. I think you're being very optimistic there. So, so I have never decorated anything before in my life, so this may or may not work out. <laughs> Don't underestimate your abilities. Oh, I'm totally underestimating them. <laughs> now, Alyssa, how did you come up with this idea? Well, I found the cookbook online, and I got it because I just love to bake. Yes. And as I was reading it, I realized that I could hold a bake sale, and it really appealed to me because it's just so fun to bake, and mm -hmm. I always have way too many treats in the house. <laughs> so do I. <laughs> I Says wish my I had scale. <laughs> so, in the process of decorating, am I am I even doing? Oh, look what you're doing. Look what you're doing with a star in the outline. I'm, I'm just trying to put wheels on a bus, but uh, the apparently wheels that's on the bus go round and round. Very nice. Not happening. No, I mean you know those little dots look like nice little wheels. Or Maybe if I mushed something. them down a little bit. Oh great, that's not gonna. Okay. Work Oh, I need the red. I need to go with the whole patriotic theme. Oh, you're making red, white, and blue? Now, at Chubbuck Days, where exactly do you know where you're going to be located? What times are you going to be there? We're going to be there from 11 to 3, and we're just going to be somewhere with all the booths. I haven't seen where I'll be yet, but okay. I know we have a spot. So, okay. um, you'll have these signs up so people can find mm -hmm. them. Now, people can also, like, purchase the cookies. Did you make yeah. these cupcakes? No, I didn't. Oh, okay. One of my neighbors did. And, oh, that's great. I've had lots of volunteers help. Yeah, I was going to say, you have other people in on the cause here but you've helping got packets you out. Of cookies that you'll be selling. Yeah. And, and tell me about what's going to go into here. Well, in exchange for treats, <laughs> we're just asking that people make a donation to Cookies for Kids Cancer. Okay. So, so there's not a charge no, there to isn't. decorate, so you can go and do it, but then you can be very generous in what you put in the <laughs> jar, right? Yep. <laughs> oh, nice. Nice Very good. So lots of opportunities to help out. Uh, and tell me a little bit about, about how they helped you during your process. Well, I just, I just um, I was always just trying to think of ways I could help other people. Oh, and cool. it always helped me get through it. Mm -hmm. So. And how long have you been cancer free now? I've been cancer free since November. Oh, Wonderful. Good deal. Good deal. Well, it's good. a good thing you're helping out. You're giving back. Um, I think I you could you sell that. That's really beautiful. That is just <laughs> not. Like I said, I'm not a decorator. Um, but, you know. I try. I try my best. But okay, look at your I, cookie. Yeah, I'm, I won't be selling did. mine, but, you know, it hmm. kind of looks like, yeah, that's, that's, that's nice. That's I like, nice. I like that. She uses her, oh, you did such a good effort. Oh, such a good effort. Yeah, pretty. Yeah, anyway. it doesn't compare to the ones that you did. Alyssa, thank you so much for coming in. And thanks for, you know, doing such a good thing. So, everyone, make sure you go to Alyssa's booth, decorate some cookies, but then fill that jar a few times over. Right in here. Okay. And let's let's see what it sounds like here. You, you, you listen, it sounds like... There you go. No, no, no. It's supposed to sound like paper going in. Yeah. <laughs> we, we like the one that jingles, but we love the one that folds. That's right. So, That's right. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining okay. us today. We appreciate that. And still to come on more, One Moose in Utah gets into a very sticky situation. And we'll have your responses to our question of the day.